Hello and welcome back to Forces. We're in the tournament and proceeding on. Uh, on this map, yeah, this map has a bit of an overhang. Uh, so I, I can't go mortars on this map because I like mortars on these hanging bases. Partially because no one expects them. Partially because you can actually get some serious damage done with it, especially really early on. But I'll go with the, uh, the rockets instead, get the EMPs out and running now. Um, this map I'm really not all that familiar with. I haven't played it all that much, so I gotta figure out how to how to build things here. I'll, I'll build my turbines right down there. Uh, I usually go for heavy weapons and I'm in this kind of fort, but usually that's in a, a 4v4 kind of style where I can get away with that. I can't do that here. And rockets are not something... Okay, well... <laughs> honestly, I kind of forgot that. <laughs> You started with a minigunner. Um, I'm so used to selling it off and there not being a minigunner in play that I forgot that it existed. Uh, but I can I can solve that problem real quick. I just gotta build some sandbags right here. Just gotta fit this guy right. So okay, let's uh, redo this a little bit. Uh, we'll just put this out here and drag it down. There we go. That'll get me. That'll get me the sandbags I need to keep these turbines alive. There we go. No more turbine harassment for you. Excellent. So much cheaper. Let's just get you up here and connect it up. Right there and beautiful. I could put a second turbine in there later. Uh, but for now, I need to get this next technology going. Let me get an upgrade center, which I can put right here, I guess. Um, yeah, ideally I'd have this place somewhere else, but it should be it should be fine there. Uh, let me just get a flak down here. Uh, my opponent is going for swarm missiles. You can see that there he's gone for the he went for the workshop and the swarm missiles so I, I do want to get that flak up and early quickly just in case something else goes wrong I, I need a place to put my sniper I, hmm. I don't want to put my sniper up here like that would be the ideal place but I'm already building my flak up here and it's about the closest spot I can get to building to having space to build my EMPs. So I'll build my EMPs up here, and I guess the snipers and machine gunners go down there. But that's like not a good place for the machine gunners, or the sniper, the sniper especially. The sniper is online. And if I still get that's unfortunate. I can kind of finish it off with a plaque here. I want to put a door on it first. Uh, yeah, let's put a door here. And we should just be able to prepare that area for EMPs. Right there are the missiles. I do want to take out that sniper first. Oh, that's unfortunate. Uh, I can't tell if it's a door or if it's an undoored sniper and I just missed. Let me try again. Uh, these sandbags are going away. The EMPs are the EMPs. Uh, the minigunners are very good at destroying. Destroying. Oh, I'm on fire. Uh, the minigunners are very good at destroying sandbags. Like, the sandbags are, are really cheap to replace and they're free to repair. But I do have to keep in mind that the sandbags are replaced periodically. There we go. Uh, with two layers of sandbags, we'll be perfectly safe. Those, those turbines. Uh, those, are, those are both upgraded to warheads. Right, so that's good to keep in mind. And that's an issue. Oh, he didn't have a door on his sniper, just straight up missed it. Flak, okay, good to know. We can shut that down. To get this upgraded to a shotgun, it'd be pretty easy to punch through that. Right, second turbine, and... Ah, uh, let's just... Okay, so... I'm just gonna build some large boxes here for the space armor, just so we could face tank the nukes and survive this. Just in case something goes wrong, like that. That counts as something going wrong. Get some anti-air up. I seem to have a hard time keeping the anti-air up. Now it's probably related to why. <laughs> Alright, let's try to take out a sniper here. Oh, come on! There's no way. There's no way. Like, we hit the sniper with so many shotguns. Alright, well, I guess we're not putting the sniper there. It's about to get nuked. Alright, we just shoot it down. Sniper, nope. It. Take the second one. Need to get my anti-air up. 
Take out the sniper. Oh, I think it's like five points. I need to find a better place to build my anti-air and my snipers, and it's a real problem. Because my base design is bad to a point that I can't use it to defend myself, and it's a real problem. Can I fit a sniper? <laughs> okay. Machine gun goes in there. Just open you for now. If we can get one running, just EMP out, slow him down any amount. We need, to, we need to get rid of this. We need to redo everything. Space like this. Okay, we're good. We're alive. Redo everything. Do it right the first time. Okay, redo, redo, build all the extra space, get away from the wall, give me a place to build there, and I need to, to not die to nukes, rebuild this, no, but let's get rid of, let's get rid of, let's get rid of this, this is, this is too much. Building a sniper post up here where we should have the first time around. There we go. Cover it all up. There we go. No nukes to deal with us. I can build a flak in here. Flak in here is fine. Especially with a shotgun. This... This needs a door. What... Do I need to defend? I need a good place for machine gunners. Uh, can I just slide one in here? Just give him something to shoot at. Uh, let's do this. Hey! Finally! Got it. Okay. A little delay. Why? could just repair that. Beautiful. Oh, good. Upgrade you. And can I slide you in here for now? Yeah, so what? Let's just have you in here for the moment. It's not a good place, but I want to have at least something to slow him down. Shotgun is coming online. Not you. Just a second sniper down here. Looks like machine gunners. I have a sniper, I don't need more snipers, I just need a better place sniper, which I have. We've already won the sniper duel once. Uh, he does have a door there now, so I'm going to try to snipe it with an AP sniper. We can hit him with the EMP to slow him down. I think his sniper just finished, so he should have that available, but we can EMP it. There's the sniper, and I hit the sniper again, also didn't blow it up. Ah, this is This is a mess. You. That's, that's that's good. That's good. Okay, that's better. Uh, I should just be able to go straight through and hit a sniper. Yeah, perfect. Right through the doors. No more of that here. Let's just make all this go away. I need a proper place to build rockets here because my base, it's a disaster. It's a disaster and I'm barely hanging on. And let's just fire the shotgun. Okay, so I did hit his EMP. Again, didn't blow it up. Let's see if we can. Oh, he doesn't have the sniper placed back. This is good for me. Nothing over there. Nothing anywhere. Great. Let's, let's, let's go away. No more machine gunner. Can we get the sniper again? Yes, okay. Uh, I'm going to go back to a normal sniper on you because he's definitely going to have double doors by now. And I don't want to have... Why are you not going to go away? Thank you. I want to have the extra fire rate as opposed to the armor penetration because he's got double doors on things. So. The armor pen isn't going to help me at all. I do want to expand down here so we can build our rockets in an actually usable location. Uh, this is a little bit deformed. It's not ideal. I could try to get it into here. Is that right there? That looks good. One door on that. That'll work. Not ideal. That'll work. Rockets out. He nuked me and that's that's illegal. Ooh. I think we took the door off the minigunner? Nope. He had a second door on the minigunner. Okay, this is, this is fine. And... Oh yeah, he's got three doors in there now. <laughs> he does not want to get sniped. Uh, that's fine, because we have rockets. That's an expensive repair bill. Are you gonna... Are you gonna open your door? Yeah, there you go. There goes the sniper. Uh, shotguns are good. Just fire this. Did we hit it? Yeah! Got it. Okay, so that'll knock the nuke off course. EMP nuke. Something we don't see over there. Radio. And we can get another rocket launcher here. Be nice and square. 
Fix the deformation. Fire everything. Shotgun and rockets. Beautiful. Okay, that's nice. Uh, let's go ahead and get another one of these rocking. We can. Okay, we finally have three rockets available. Isn't it amazing? Just build your base right the first time and it actually works. Uh, why am I like this? I'm absolutely gonna need some. I'm gonna need more than four turbines. Especially because these aren't 100% efficient turbines. I'm gonna need. I'm gonna need more to keep this going. I think just with the shotgun and the rockets kind of constantly hitting him, it's gonna be a little bit too expensive for him to repair. Let's get, just fire everything. I have the energy for it now. Ooh, that was a beautiful hit. That's what I want to see. Fire everything. So much damage. Steal some of his monies. That EMP of his is still active. Still behind all those tiny doors. He's got a lot of doors on these things. Yes, this is fine. Nothing of value was lost. Fixed. Alright, so we're all fixed off of that. Uh, fire again. Just fire everything. Give him all the rockets you can see fit. Take the battery back here so we can fire things. Get some more energy production going. Keep up the fire rate. I think his turbines are exposed right now. So I should be able to blow everything up. Uh, fire. Upgrade you. Upgrade, thank you. And oh, his EMP is exposed. Come on, a little bit lower. Just get the EMP. Just get the EMP. Ah, there we go. Perfect. You take care of these nukes. One of them. Second one is drug. Information, we fix. I need to put Snipey back as well as Flak. Um, I could do a better redesign, but I'm just gonna fire everything. Just blow me up. I can return in kind. Snipey's door. Thank you. Uh, should I put a door beneath? I should put a door beneath, but I'm not going to because it's expensive. Just cover you up for now. It's not so expensive. Flak is out of the door. I think should get out here and here. Ooh. Ooh, those hit really hard. Uh, that's better. Just get rid of this. Fix, fix everything. Fire everything. Much better. Much better. Can I expand this out further? Like, I could just... Right, right here. Perfect. Just foreground bracing. There we go. Even more nuke protection. That's better to see. Right, so we are fully operational again. Shotgun out. And rockets away. Any more turbines? Expand the economy while we can. Get one more turbine. Fire weapons. Stop the nuke. Mm, that's so close. Oh, we're almost out of time. Uh, energy. Shotgun. Hit it. Just got a battery. Hit it with the rockets. Come on. Fire, fire, fire everything. Hey, got him! Ooh, talk about... Ooh, that was close. All right, see. And we're off to round two. This time on Abyss, and I like Abyss. This is one that I'm familiar with, and one that I, uh... I've played quite a fair amount of. One that I really like mortars on, so I think we're going to do that, because I, I do like the mortars, and also conveniently lets me go for these swarm missiles, as you guys, as you guys may be aware. 
there is a place to build a swarm missile, a single place to build a swarm missile on this map, and most of the time people don't expect it, and it catches them off guard, because suddenly, is he building turbines up there, or weapons, maybe? Uh, in another case, I'm going to build a sniper, just in case he comes out with weapons. I uh, might be able to buzzsaw that too. I need a turbine. Let's just build turbines in the proper locations. Like, I can. It's a little bit more expensive to do it this way, but this is the spot for turbines to go where it can be easily defended. And they are 100% and will never be in the way. Alright. Thank you. I can get a buzzsaw. If he's gonna leave it there, I could just buzzsaw all of that down. I think I'm gonna do that. Uh, it's not quite ready for it. Okay, let's just get ready to move on. Um, extra mine. Go up to four mines. It's about buzzsaw time. What have you got in here? What do you have in here? Something with background bracing is blown up. Right, so buzzsaw can just hide in here for now. Hopefully he doesn't. Hopefully he doesn't fix his his expansion area. Shouldn't be too concerned about it. Let's just cover this. Uh, I do want to build mortars. So we'll need to build a platform from them. Uh, he's got one spot with background bracing. So I gotta look out for that. Let's get a battery back here. That's not right. Cover all of this. And. Alright, let's bust saw him. I do want another turbine while we're at it, but let's try to nail this shot. Beautiful. Perfect. Alright, so that's two down and disconnected his mine. Uh, that's gonna be good. That's gonna be really good. And now I can just put mortars right up here. That should be good. One more. Perfect. Okay, so we've got the, the mortars placed. We can do a lot of damage with that. He's got more... He's, he's just rebuilding it. This is fine. I can just shut that down once more. Oh, we built a sniper up there. That's convenient and inconvenient. And return fire. Oh, okay. He's got a door on that. That's fine. Uh, let me connect down to the swarm missile spot so I can be ready to build the swarm missile. But for now, let's just get these mortars firing because we can. Defend our front a little bit better. That'll do. And I don't know what the angle is for this. Uh, that's a little high. As much as I like hitting his mines, I'd rather, I'd rather hit actually... Oh, I hit myself. Okay, I gotta fix that. That's a good spot. Right on top of his core where he has to actually actively defend it. Right, so I need to build all of this up here. To fix mortars for now. We just aim a little bit to the side. That should work out. There we go. I think I'm hitting his sniper as well. As I said, sniper is just right on top of his core. That's fine. Just refire these. Right, I do want to expand down here, up there, because I can get I can get some more turbines. There's the sniper. Ooh, yeah, he's ready to fire his missile. Okay, that's fine. It's just a swarm missile. Yeah, we are already hitting his core. Uh, this is gonna be. This is this is nice. Uh, I do want to expand, upgrade those, expand our firepower. Can I fit my? How far away are we from this? A little bit, a little bit good to go. Fire everything. Um, is he building mortars up there? Okay. Uh, just in case he's building mortars, I'm going to cover these. I don't want those to get destroyed, and I can build machine gunners right up there. Just about. Yeah, he does have mortars. Okay, so why don't we just undo this? Because, yep, and that's why we cover our own mortars. Because we don't want our mortars to get hit. Aim high. And a little low, but that's pretty good. So his mortars aren't right on top. A bit more power that should hit his mortars here. Yes, beautiful. Okay, that's what we want to see. We took a hit. Can I? Yeah, 
that'll help me keep the mortars alive. Maybe we need some burn damage. That's fine. Alright, uh, I should be able to get the missile going here. Yes, excellent. And can I snipe anything? Okay, it's all got doors. Just fire everything, please. Thank you. Beautiful. Um, I do not want to snipe this, please. Stop. Okay, so now we can just keep hammering, hammering that spot. I don't even mind just the mortar anymore. As long as I hammer where his eco is and... It's... Oh, he's selling. Uh... Bye! Alright guys, if you want to see more episodes just like this, make sure to hit that like button. But for now, I will see you guys later.